Chin Targeting This video will illustrate a shaping plan for training a chin target to hand behavior. This is a simple body targeting behavior with wide-ranging applications, from teaching competition behaviors, therapy dog skills, assistance tasks, and numerous complex tricks. Some examples will be listed later in the video. Step 1. Reach under the dog's chin and touch it with your hand. Then, click and treat. Do this approximately 20 times during your first one-minute session. This serves two purposes. First, it draws attention to the target area on the dog's body. Second, it conditions the dog to happily accept a human hand reaching toward her face. For dogs who are initially uncomfortable with this, you will need to break this step down further. You might start with 20 repetitions reaching halfway toward the dog, 20 repetitions three quarters of the way, 20 repetitions directly under her chin, and 20 repetitions actually touching her chin. But break this down into as many increments as necessary for your dog to be comfortable and enjoy the process. Step 2. Place your hand a quarter of an inch below the dog's chin and shape downward movements. Click and treat for the slightest head dips at first. Make it more difficult once the dog is successful at 80% or 4 out of 5 trials with the criteria of 1 quarter inch distance from the chin. When they're successful at 1 quarter inch, then increase to 1 half inch then one inch, and beyond in future sessions. Step 3. Begin presenting your hand a few inches to the right or left. When the dog is successful at this step, begin to present your hand at random positions. Right, left, down lower, and up higher. Begin to generalize. Generalize the position of the trainer. Train while standing, sitting, leaning over your dog, and while kneeling. Train in different locations, both inside and outside. And train around different objects. Jim. Adding the cue. At this stage, Jim. the presentation of your hand has become the cue for your dog to perform this behavior. You may also choose to name the behavior with a verbal cue. Having a verbal cue is helpful for trick training. It will give you more versatility for future advanced training. Jim? To add the verbal cue, give the verbal cue just Jim? before presenting your hand. Jim? Oh. I chose to use the cue chin. Jim? Jim? If you want your dog to respond only to the verbal cue and to wait for the verbal Jim. cue, then once your dog understands the verbal cue, Jim. begin presenting your hand just before you give the cue Jim. and only click when your dog waits for the verbal cue. Good. Time this so that your dog maintains Jim. a high rate of success. If she occasionally offers the behavior before Jim. you cue, then wait for her to stop then immediately give the cue. If she offers the behavior Jim? before the cue more than 50% of the time, Jim? then you've gone too fast. In this case, reduce the delay between presenting your hand and the verbal cue. Once your dog is intentionally waiting for the cue 
80% of the time, then wait slightly longer before giving the verbal cue. Adding duration. You can add duration to your chin target behavior by delaying the click while the dog's chin rests on your hand. Begin with one second and slowly build up to the desired amount of duration. Set your criteria to maintain a high rate of success throughout this process and ping pong between easier, that is shorter, and harder, that is longer, achievable intervals of duration. You can also transfer your hand target to a stick or an object to extend your reach or to place the object at a distance to cue the chin rest behavior. Start by presenting the object first, followed by presenting your hand and the verbal cue as you were doing before. After several repetitions, begin to fade your hand by placing it below the object and then slightly further away and continue to take your hand further away until it is out of the picture completely and only the target object remains. The final look of this behavior is your dog comfortably resting her head on your cupped hand or on your target object with duration. You don't have to stop there. You can also transfer this targeting behavior to other objects and surfaces. And once you've done that, begin using the chin target to teach new exciting behaviors. This simple body targeting skill can be used as an incremental step toward building numerous, more complex behaviors. In competition obedience, you can use the chin target to more quickly build duration for your take and hold, to build precision for the recall in front position, and to build precision for healing positions. If you're interested in learning how to use the chin target for competition obedience, I highly recommend resources by Hannah Brannigan on this subject. Chin. For the therapy dog, Chin. you could teach your dog to lay his head at the edge of a patient's bed Chin. or on their lap for petting. For the service dog, Chin. this behavior can be used to teach retrieve skills, delivery skills, and Chin. precise object placement. The chin target is also Chin. used to teach husbandry behaviors. That is, to voluntarily, confidently, and happily stand still for exams, mouth exams, dental hygiene procedures, and to hold steady and relax for other various procedures. The chin target can help anxious and fearful dogs by teaching them relaxed body positions, such as laying their head down, and to build confidence around scary objects. For the excited and high-energy dog, you can use the chin target to help teach impulse control. Chin. Sit. And of course, the focus of this video, the chin target is useful for teaching yeah. many impressive tricks, chin. such as interacting with props, a head cock, yeah. balance a treat or object on the Sit. nose, chin. holding objects, cover your eyes, head down, say your yeah. prayers, hide your head, Relax. basketball, throw away a tissue, tidy up toys, and many, many more. This is just a sample of the many exciting things you can work on with your new chin target to hand behavior. Relax. If this video has been helpful, please like, subscribe, and share. Thank you for watching, and as always, happy clicking.
Rex. Relax.